Greetings to everybody. Today we are going to see about some basic concepts in organic chemistry. First we are going to see about the substrate and reagent. Substrate is nothing but an organic compound which undergoes chemical transformation and reagent is an inorganic compound that brings about organic reaction. There are six types of organic reactions. They are substitution reaction, addition reaction, elimination reaction, redox reaction, rearrangement reaction and pericyclic reaction. First we are going to say about substitution reaction. In substitution reaction, the substrate is replaced by another group of reagent. In this, CH3Cl plus NaOH, the chlorine atom is replaced by the OH ion. So it is called substitution reaction. Then addition reaction. In addition reaction, one or two molecules of the reagent are added to a multiple bonded system. In this, the double bonded ethene when reacts with hydrogen atom, it gives ethane. Then elimination reaction. One or two molecules of the substrate are expelled to produce multiple bonded compounds. This is elimination reaction. In this, the ethyl alcohol when treated with sulfuric acid, it gives double bonded compound ethene and water. Then redox reaction. In redox reaction, the reagent brings change in oxidation number of carbon atom of the substrate. In this, the main point is the oxidation number of the carbon atom of the substrate is only changed. It may be either oxidative or reductive. If it is oxidative, it, is, it leads to increase in oxidation number. If it is reductive, it leads to decrease in oxidation number. An example of oxidation reaction is ethyl alcohol treated with H2SO4 in the presence of chromium trioxide. Chromium trioxide is an acidic anhydride of chromic acid. It is dark purple in color. We get acetic acid. The oxidation number of ethyl alcohol is minus 2. After the reaction, the acetic acid oxidation number is plus 2. So it is an example of oxidation reaction. Then reduction reaction. In reduction reaction, the acetaldehyde is treated with lithium aluminium hydride. Then it becomes CH3CH2OH. The acetaldehyde's oxidation number is 0 and the product's oxidation number is minus 2. So it is an example of reduction reaction. Then rearrangement reaction. In rearrangement reaction, the bond connectivity within the molecule changes to give different compound but it will be the same molecular formula. This happens due to the migration of one atom to a new location. If it happens within the molecule, then it is called intramolecular rearrangement. If it happens between two different molecules, then it is called intermolecular rearrangement. The last one, pericyclic reaction. The pericyclic reaction is nothing but just the electron reorganization of substrate takes place in this reaction. It happens through a cyclic transition state. The most important and notable thing is it gives stereospecific products under heat and light. That's all friends. Thank you for watching the video.